Are you tired of booking the perfect vacation only to find yourself stuck in endless queues of tourists who had also booked the perfect vacation? Well, never again. Here are the countries with the least amount of tourists. You're welcome. No, before you go. Number one, Bhutan, Asia. Just over a quarter of a million people visit this isolated Himalayan kingdom every year. You can visit monasteries and immerse yourselves in its culture while taking beautiful walks through its breathtaking snow-capped mountains and luscious valleys. Number two, French Guiana. With only 190,000 visitors a year, Guyana was the least visited country in South America. It has a rich Creole heritage, fantastic beaches, spectacular waterfalls and vast areas of unspoilt jungle. If you're thinking of going there, remember that it is French. So remember to bring some Euros. Number 3. Bangladesh most people have heard of this country, but surprisingly few visit it. Just 125,000 people a year. Better known for its dense population and poverty, Bangladesh isn't only the worldwide cool center. It has the largest mangrove forests in the world, lush green jungles and picturesque tea plantations, as well as an abundance of wildlife, including the magnificent Royal Bengal tiger. Number 4. Liechtenstein Just 79,000 people visited Liechtenstein in 2017, making it nearly the least visited country in Europe. This tiny country boasts massive alpine views and actually looks like it belongs in a fairy tale. Number 5. Timor-Leste 74,000 people visit this relatively new country that claimed independence from Indonesia in 2002. The abundance of marine wildlife here is amazing, with hammerhead sharks, turtles, manta rays, frogfish, ghost pipefish, dolphins, humpback whales, sperm whales, and even the endangered dugong. Number 6. Sierra Leone only 54,000 people visit Sierra Leone a year. But as it recovers from war and Ebola outbreaks, more and more people are visiting its beautiful coastlines, national parks and lush rainforests, where you may catch a sight of the rare pygmy hippo. Number 7. Sao Tome and Principe Only a little bigger than their better-known cousin, the Seychelles, and despite their stunning beauty, these islands are only visited by 29,000 people a year. Sao Tome has beautiful architecture and beaches, and Principe is so biodiverse it has been declared an UNESCO Biosphere Reserve. These islands are definitely worth a visit. Number 8. Comoros Comprised of three islands, 28,000 people visit them a year, which is surprising considering that Comoros has almost untouched coral reefs, virgin rainforests, active volcanoes, and it's home to the mongoose lemur, giant turtles, and living stone bats. Number 9. Montserrat with just 8,000 visitors a year, it's the least visited island in the Caribbean. This is probably due to its active volcano, which erupted in the mid-1990s, covering the capital in ash and forcing two-thirds of the population to emigrate. Although we don't recommend living there, it's definitely worth a visit. Number 10. Tuvalu Tuvalu has a total land area of just 10 square miles, so it's easily missed. Just 2,000 people visit it a year, but those who do can immerse themselves in the Indonesian culture whilst enjoying its crystal clear water, beautiful beaches and coral reefs. Which one would you choose to visit? Comment below!